Uh, Richard Vaughn. Good question, Richard Vaughn. Thank you for a what? Uh, thank you for a five dollars super chat. What do you do when your SD card takes a crap on your Radio Master TX16s? Okay, guys, if you buy <laughs> just about any radio in FPV, really, just about anyone. They all come with an absolute garbage SD card that was bought for three cents, okay? Now, I don't know, somewhere out there, someone sells an SD card with like a good, a radio with a good quality SD card, okay? Probably the TBS Tango, because that seems like the kind of thing TBS would do, is actually have a good quality SD card, right? Because they, they, this just seems like a move they would make. But most of them, the SD card is absolute garbage. It will die. It'll die, and maybe it's in three months, or maybe it's in a year. It will die. So when you get a new radio, one of the first things I do is I take the SD card out. I copy the contents to a new, good quality SD card. It doesn't have to be like a big 64 gig, 128 gig. It could be just two or four gig. Now, nobody, nobody makes a two gig SD card anymore except for the little cheap-ass three-cent ones that they buy to put in the radios. So just get a $15. doesn't have to be fast. It doesn't have to be fancy. Just get a name-brand SD card for $10 or $15. Put it in your radio. Throw out the one that came with the radio. The day you get it, it probably is trash, and it probably is going to die on you. So when the SD card takes a crap and dies on you, then what do you do? You have to download the SD card contents again. Hopefully you had a backup. If you don't have a backup, you have to go to the OpenTX website or the EdgeTX website and download the SD card contents. And any customizations you had, unfortunately, are going to be gone.